y'all. It's Maddie from the Itty Bitty Homestead Committee. I got to run to Walmart real quick. We got some stuff to do and I thought I'd bring you along. So let's hop into it. You're happy about this, aren't you? Is you happy about the snow? Nope. Let's go get the horsies. Come on. Let's go wake everyone up. Morning, Dallas. Goat. Max and Max. Morning, babies. Morning. Morning, babies. Good morning, chicky chicks. Good morning, my queen. Gotta get the cages back in the barn. Morning, babies. Good morning. Hi. Hi, babies. Good morning, my loves. Hello. Good morning. Do we have babies yet, Nini? Any babies? No, no babies. What about you, Gwen? Penguin, you got any babies in there? You got any babies? Lucifer? Babies? No babies? Darn. Are you guys ready to come out? Come greet the day. Oh, I just pulled the door off and just... Good morning, babies. The dumb dumb that forgot to plug in the truck it's me i don't know if it will start because it's cold come on baby come on come on yeah there we go good girl ah <gasps> is you beautiful is you ready go ready go Can I please get a vanilla iced coffee, please? Yeah. Anything else? That's all. Thank you so much. Want? Yes, please. Awesome. I'm going to see you at the first window. Thank you. My pleasure. Just made it to Walmart, and um, the highway isn't even clear yet. Uh, so we were just cruising at 40 the whole way through. And the bad thing about when the highway isn't clear down the mountain pass is that there's snow and it's packed so it's slickery compared to on the like the more back roads it's still powdery and easy to get traction so oops uh but we're gonna head into Wally world right now and get some stuff done so <laughs> So walking through all our Walmart, I realized I've never actually looked at their rabbit food, so I decided to take a look-see. And to be honest, it's a little bit pricey, but when looking at the back of the back, the protein percentage is pretty good, and the other splits are nice as well. The only thing that I really didn't like about it is when I was looking through the ingredients list, the first ingredient was wheat middlings, which is a little too carby for what I like. I normally like to see the alfalfa or soybean higher up, and if there is alfalfa middlings, I like it at the bottom. And then you also want to be super careful with corn when it comes to rabbit feeds, just because it can make rabbits 
gassy. So as y'all know, we normally feed raw. And we, what we normally do is we do 50% raw, 50% kibble. Okay, good to go. So I talked to my husband the other night and I'm like, what do you think about going 100% raw? We'll make sure they have their vitamins. We'll talk to our nutritionalist. Everything will be good. We can skip on the kibble. And he's like, yeah, sure. And I don't know if he was tired or just half listening. This morning I get up, the dog's uh, meals are in the sink thawing out from the freezer. And he goes to go feed the cats and then he looks at the empty bucket beside it and goes, where's the dog kibble? Dog kibble, what are you talking about? He goes, the dog kibble, the babies are starving. And it's like, Danny, we, we talked about feeding them 100% raw now. And he goes, no, they'll starve to death. They have to have access to kibble at all times. So I guess we're not feeding 100% raw. And if I take the kibble away from the dogs of all access, um. They're going to starve to death according to Danny. So I picked up some kibble. We're still feeding 50-50, I guess, but it got me giggling because it's like, well, hey, that's not what we talked about. So yeah, that's the fun on the homestead. <laughs> but it's time to head home and I need to see if the roads have cleared up. I've been in Walmart gallivanting for about 30 minutes. So I'm hoping in that 30 minutes, they have gotten the roads at least somewhat cleared off. I'm not very hopeful though. Maybe the highway, but probably not our road onto the private road, so, ugh. So the roads were in fact not better than they were earlier, so we slid all over the road. It was a good time. I forgot to put the truck in the correct gear, but yeah, no, we're good now. We got home safe. But yeah, that's really the exciting part of today. I gotta get some tattooing done. I'm going to do a rabbit tree tour for another video. So hopefully I'll see y'all there. But that's really all I have for you today. So I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye.